the city line and the crazy nights I figure I should probably give it a try Baby, check it out See Stopped at the Amish Roadside Market Hope Steve's coming back Let's see what he has to say now that corn there, is, it says picked yesterday, but it's only four fifty a dozen. You want it? Yeah, I'd like some corn too. A dozen? Yeah. Okay. And I told him to get some mushmelon or cantaloupe, whatever you want to call it. Mom got some yesterday, I think it was, and brought us some of it, and oh, it was delicious. So we decided to run out and buy some more, and... I believe that they are um, Mennonite because the man that is waiting on everyone, he doesn't have a beard. Yeah, they've got a nice, oh, sorry about that, car pulled in. But anyway, they've got a beautiful farm here, a uh, big barn and all of those uh, greenhouses. Yeah, it's really nice. I'll try to show the pond when we pull out. It's a beautiful house, isn't it? Let me zoom up here for you. And you can see over there. Well, they've got play stuff for the kids. And, the and right over there's the pond. All right, sweetie, what was the... The prices on that? The two cantaloupe I got, I got the smaller one, so they's three twenty-five a piece. And then uh, the corn was four fifty for a dozen, so it was eleven fifty for everything. Oh, uh, okay. It's an Amish buggy. Oh, little kids <laughs> hanging out. rained good last night, thank the good Lord, because as about everywhere else, it's been so dry. Our yard is so brown looking. They, uh, well, it started out today that it was supposed to rain at 3 o'clock, then it went to 4 o'clock, then it went to 5 o'clock, now it's supposed to rain around 6 o'clock, so we'll see. If it rains or if not. If it rains or not, because they just keep pushing it back farther and farther. Yeah. Well, at least we got a bunch last night. It actually yeah. filled up the fountain. Yeah. And both bird baths. <laughs> oh. Oh, the one, did you pick it up? Yeah. It had water in the bowl, so I just picked it up and set it back up. up I wonder there. what made that fall. I don't know. Yeah, our bird bath had fallen over. I'm glad it didn't break. showed up of the church but I have never got a chance to come back on and let everybody know that we ended up merging with that church back there and um, actually we're down to three names um, and the church will pick when will the winning name be where we'll build uh, well, the, well the three names will give out Sunday I, the 18th We'll know what the name is. Okay, what three are left? <sighs> Hillstone, Grace, and oh my gosh, I think Mercy, but I'm not for sure. Okay. The name that I wanted uh, made it all the way till last time, wasn't it? Yeah. Trinity. And uh, so, bummer. That one didn't make it to the final, but that's okay. But Steve and I were both talking, and out of those that are left, we both chose Hillstone. And what was the reason for that? Because Jesus was crucified on the hill, and the stone was rolled into, uh, in front of the tomb. And, and then, then it, rolled away. Yeah, he rolled the stone away. So, yeah, I think I like that one. It sounds kind of old-fashioned, but yet got a, a modern Yeah was to it also. So I'll let you guys know what the church decides on. And you probably should let everybody know why they're changing the name of the church just because we merged. Well, because uh, you got two churches, so 
we decided that we didn't want to be just one church name or the other and since we were starting new we all wanted a new name too so we decided everybody everybody got to write down a name that they want and we went from there so everybody in the church has participated the whole time you know of getting the names everybody's got to vote on stuff on them and everything so yeah and that way the church will have since it had to have a new banking and all that has yeah. to be new yeah it will have its own new yeah. what identity or whatever identity. yeah so i didn't know if you if anyone out there that's watching you know would wonder why they would change the name yeah it's kind of funny me going to church there now because when they was building that church dad had a small dump truck and me and him hauled all the gravel for the parking lot and dumped it in the parking lot dad would bring a load and dump it and spread it out some and i'd take a rake and a shovel and wheelbarrow and spread it out more we did that whole parking lot while they were building the the church building. When so, was that about? Do you that remember? That was in 1982. Oh. So, <laughs> that's when they built that church, was in 1982. So that was probably before you and I met. Oh, yeah. Huh. Because we didn't start dating until September, the end of September in 84. So. But I meant when I met you at uh, the other church. Oh. So you wasn't a Christian at that time. No. No. Well, that's really cool that you did that. I'm sure you got paid. <laughs> yeah. Did you? You don't remember? I don't remember. <laughs> Hi, Ziva. Dad probably got Hi, paid. Hi, baby girl. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> I don't know if I did or not, but... <laughs> Look, she just lays her little head on our shoulders. <laughs> we decided that we are going to go for a drive or a ride. Right, Ziva? She's looking at these people walking by. She loves everyone, absolutely loves people, and we took her to Rural King yesterday to get the some chicken feed, and she's allowed to go into Rural King and walk around on her leash. Oh my goodness, she loves everybody. She just wants everybody to pet her and love on her, and uh, yeah, she's a good girl, aren't you, sweetheart? Yeah, person, I have to watch her because she'll get me in my mouth. <laughs> But yeah, she's good. She's learned some tricks. I'll show you guys uh, if I remember later on when we get home. She can sit. Well, she's working on that one. Not real good at that yet. But she knows how to shake. But as soon as I do that, she will she'll shake. So I'll show you when we get home. If um, She's very intelligent. If I had, I guess I'm going to have to get on YouTube and look for some easy dog tricks and teach her because she loves to learn and she learns so quickly it's amazing so yeah looks like it's gonna storm and i told steve let's go for a ride in the storm right and she loves going for rides don't you ziva you love going for rides yeah <laughs> all right honey how much you want to show your um pretzel and this is again at Sam's Club. And that yeah. is how much? The pretzels are a dollar a piece. Oh, that's a good deal. And okay, what about my... Your hot dog and pop is a dollar thirty-eight for both of them. Oh my goodness, that's even better. So one. for your hot dog pop, us two pretzels is three dollars and thirty-eight cents. Wow. And I... oh, they got cheddar cheese today. So I got you a cheddar cheese. Oh. And if I wouldn't have just ate two hot dogs at home, you I would, would have, have got a hot aw. dog. <laughs> okay, let me show everybody, hon. All right, here's the hot dog. And the beef one is just as big, too. But yeah, you can. You can see the cheese in that. Let me get me some relish and stuff on it. And then the... And that's the size of the drink. So, and man, that's a good deal for cheap lunch, huh? Somebody wanted to drive into the storm, Dinah. So we did. <laughs> oh, 
a good thing. <laughs> yeah, the car needed washed in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's, that's good though, she's learning. That's a good girl.